fairy friends. Here I am in the fairy workshop and the, the little fairies aren't here yet. They come at night, you see, to make the fairy doors. But while they're not here, I thought I might take the opportunity just to show you what you get inside a fairy door box. Look. Here we have a very nice trading box. Isn't it beautiful? Lovely. Beautiful gift box for a beautiful door. Inside your gift box, you'll see it's all wrapped up pretty. There's the door inside, the sparkly tissue paper. When you've unwrapped your door and you've got it out of the tissue paper, then this is what you'll see. <gasps> Look, this is one of our beautiful great bunting doors. There is hand paint for all those little hearts, you know. So you get your fairy door out. Here's your fairy door. You might choose a different one. I like this one though. Here's your fairy door. Isn't it pretty? And then with your bunting door, of course, you get an extra special little pot of fairy dust, which we've had to wrap up in bubble wrap because we don't want it to break on the way. And you get a pretty little card, a special occasion card. It could be for a birthday or a christening or just to say I love you. That's sweet, isn't it? It's all different kinds. You don't know what you're going to get, you know. Fairies like a surprise. Every single door, not just the bunting doors, comes with a personalised letter to your little one. The fairies love writing those letters. They try and make them as special as possible. We ask you for a few little details, like names and special occasions, and uh, if there's a particular fairy that's going to come through the door to visit them. But if you've got anything else you'd like to put in it, just let us know. So when you've ordered your door, we'll ask you for all those personalisation details just by sending you a little email. So keep an eye on that inbox. And we've also got a little card here that just reminds you that the fairy doors aren't really a toy. If you play around with the fairy doors too much, you might scare the fairies away. And that would be dreadful, wouldn't it? So, look at the time. They're almost here. I better get going. They're very hard taskmasters, the fairies. But I do enjoy my job, really. Don't let them know that, though. They might not give me a pay rise next week. So hopefully I'll see you again soon. If you enjoyed seeing what was in the fairy box, leave a little comment under this post. I'd really love to hear from you. It gets awfully lonely when the fairies aren't here during the day. <laughs>